Hi, I'm Jacques. Here's my wife Sue. Hello. Today we're going to do a small demo of the Blue Retro project. This is an adapter to use Bluetooth controller on a retro gaming console. So this is my entry for uh, Acadé uh, Prize uh, 2020 in the wildcard uh, category. So let's play a game. Let's start with uh, Dreamcast. Mm -hmm. So for this one, I'm going to use a PS3 controller. So when we start the game, first thing to do is just associate the controller. So it's going to use an arcade stick. Let's go. Yeah, that's good. Thanks. <laughs> We'll just do a VS battle. It's already. So, right now we're just using the default uh, setting of the adapter for that game. Sue's the best at fighting games. Hey. <laughs> uh. Okay, I'm at. Okay, let's just close the controller now. I'm gonna switch uh, to uh, GameCube. PS3 is always long to close, okay. Good. I switch to GameCube. So the adapter auto detect the system, so it's just plug and play. This. So this one I'm gonna use a Switch Pro controller. So we'll be using the Wii U Pro controller. So we can pick go up. So even though no controllers is uh, associated, the adapter always display uh, a controller. So you can just so the game's gonna see four controller. Even if you have only two controller, you can play a quick game. Yeah, a few things. That's it for that game. So let's <laughs> so just close the controller with the red button. Mm -hmm. okay, switch to Nintendo 64. So before connecting a uh, the controller for that one we're gonna actually change the configuration of the adapter so this is uh, only possible before uh, we connect uh, the controller so what we're gonna do here 
So I could put one. And we may use the, the two joystick of one Bluetooth controller to control to control both N N N64 controller. So it's called uh, the config is a golden eye the 2.2 multiplayer configuration. So we just save that to the adapter. I'm gonna use a, a Xbox uh, One uh, S controller, so we'll be using a PlayStation 4 controller. Configuration didn't work, so I think just need to refresh this, reconnect. Uh, but now we have a controller, so we just need to close the controller. I'll be now you find So now that I close the controller, I can see the adapter, I can pair again to it. Uh, I can do the issue. Right, we got it. So this time we're gonna configure it for real uh, multiplayer 2.2 control style. Input one, save, and then we do the same on input two. So stuff never goes to to plan when you do live demo, but that's not like that. So now you can come to SSC controller back. I'm just pressing. It. Now we're fine. We can go multiplayer, two player, and then we can go control style, and we're gonna select two point two. No, uh, uh, square, press square, and then select two point two. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah. So now we're gonna play pretty much what this does. The first stage is gonna be configure as the second controller analog stick and the right stick is going to be configured as the first controller analog stick. So right now we, the game is using four controllers even though it's mapped on two uh, Bluetooth devices. So let's just give it a go. No, we need to use a joystick. So the rumble pack is uh, emulated. So when we shoot, uh, we have the rumble from the Bluetooth controller. So just press uh, X to get the gun. <coughs> oh, that's a uh, hard for me. It's the trigger here. To shoot. Yeah, so they can Yeah, shoot me. No, I can't press that. Okay, turn it around. Okay. Okay, shoot. Yeah, you got me. You win. Okay. So thank that was the demo for the cube uh, uh, the blue retro adapter. So see ya.